Hello, and welcome to part 2 of the Hometown Folk series. The 30 Years War hasn't always been as much fun as this image might suggest. Towns were being looted and robbed multiple times, innocent civilians were being tortured and killed, people all over Europe were suffering from hunger and starvation, and if you were particularly unlucky, you gotta enjoy a so-called Swedish drink, which is basically piss and shit being forced down your throat. Now, 40 years later, after the war had ended, Life in South Germany hasn't been good, but better. The crops had grown back and people were okay. But the inhabitants of my hometown, they had learned something from this crisis and they started to think about how to make their harvest safe from robbery or looting in the future. Finally, they came to the conclusion that it would be best to store their grain way up in the roof of the town's church, which is Saint Margareta. Fittingly, Margaret the Virgin is the patron saint for farmers in Christianity. This is her happily beating up a demon. Anyway, there was a problem. Because at that point, the church pretty much was a piece of crap. First, the attic was in a ruinous state, and second, apparently they had a lot of mice living up there. And because of this, for the next 40 years, it kept happening that from time to time, grain would fall down from above through the cracks on the heads of the church visitors. So I thought younger folk couldn't have known about the storage thing. They might have taken it for a miracle or a gift from above because people back then they were just superstitious and stupid. And that is the story of this song. It's raining grain in Saint Margaret. They had left They chomp and they spill There is crumbs falling through 